Oh my god, I didn't even have that set up yet. Oh dear. Oh well, dear lord. Well, anyway, well, well. I was not in a Kira video unless there's like some sort of scuff once in a while. Yeah. Well, everything is set up properly now, though. Uh, but with all that said, uh, hey, how's it going, Fox Squad? My name is Akira Strix or Trickster Fox, whichever you want to go with. And as you guys probably know by now, my name is Andrew. I am the YouTuber, critic, reviewer of games, movies, YouTubers, TV series, and streamers. And if Akira's planning what I think he's planning, if you guys have been watching for the past few weeks, oh, we're in for a good time here. Well, maybe. But, uh, yeah, so you might notice this HUD is a little different. That is because I have my GameCube set up this time around. But of course, this is only going to mull us over, or at least this is meant to mull pretty much all of you, as well as pretty much the rest of us, over until I eventually get ready to uh, do uh, Travis Strikes Again, as well as No More Heroes 3. But, uh, you know, by the time I'm recording this, I still have yet to get the rest of the uh, No More Heroes 2 videos edited. And uploaded. Hey, take your time, no rush. Indeed. But anyway, welcome to the world of the Nintendo GameCube. Uh, and the let me see, uh, NES, Super Nintendo, fourth console in the Nintendo library. Uh, technically the fifth, if you want to count the Game and Watch stuff. Fair point. Yeah, but in any case. The game in question that I want to play today is uh, one that uh, I'm sad to say does not get uh, that much love, but it's it's understandable to an extent, but I will get into that when I do. So um, the game in question today is going to be one that I have a bit of a soft spot for, and the game in question is Disney's Magical Mirror starring Mickey Mouse, released in 2002 for exclusively for the Nintendo GameCube and developed, believe it or not, not by Disney Interactive, but by Capcom. Capcom and Disney have worked hand in hand so many times in the past, mainly with the Magical Quest series for Super Nintendo and the port for Game Boy Advance. It's funny you say that. So... Yeah, so if you can tell by this uh, cursor that I'm going to be using, and yes, this is not the last time we'll be seeing this. Um, let's uh, select normal. Okay. Okay, so right off the bat, you see this link button. Yes. So, uh, okay. So when this game Wait, came out... you're not saying... What? That you can connect the Magical Quest games that are on GBA or, like, some sort of special items in the game. Uh, well, technically the first one. Well, technically the first GBA game, not the other two. Because, uh, because the other two ports uh, came out later. That is a fair point, especially since, uh... Two and three were under different titles, though. Two was the only one that was released in the U.S. for both Super Nintendo and Genesis, while the third game was Japan exclusive. Yeah, that's right. Um, and I do have, and maybe at some point I might. Uh, yeah, we need. Yeah, we definitely need to turn off Rumble because it, it's not compatible with the Wave Bird, which is what I'm using. I had to go to Wavebird, everyone's favorite wireless controller. <laughs> yeah, there are like more modern iterations of that. I think there's one called the Falcon. Falcon Punch! <laughs> uh, but uh, I don't know how, but, but uh, I have to look into that more because uh, I don't know how much it goes for by comparison. I'll look it up real quick. All right. Anyways, uh, uh, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know exactly what uh, what special surprises in question 
uh, this game has with uh, the first magical quest, and no, I don't want to organize my desktop right now, Windows, thank you. Huh. That's $25 on Amazon. On Amazon, wow. Hmm. Yeah. Cool. Not bad. All right, well, ready for the uh, magical quest? Uh, not magical quest. <laughs> magical, sorry, magical mirror. Let's go into the world of the mirror. Okay, there we go. By the way, never mind the aspect ratio that you're probably looking at right now, because that is how it is presented in the game. To be honest, I like it. I mean, I never played the games. I've seen playthroughs of it, and to be honest, the way it's presented just reminds me of, like, you're playing an old cartoon. Pretty much, and I think the whole premise of, uh, of, um, Mickey going into a, uh, going into this mirror, it's based on that one old short. I cannot remember the name of it right off the through bat. Through the mirror. Oh, through the mirror. Yep. A lot of the classic Mickey Mouse shorts that has gotten a lot of love throughout the years. Yeah, and uh, I do think we. Especially I think it's. Some, yeah, I think it's. I think at a certain point in this game, I don't know how far I will get this time around, but I know there's a part where, um, where, uh, I know there's a part where. I think you have to get the TV in a certain room working, and it'll show, like, certain shorts. And one of them is a, a piece from the, 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 the one that's the through mirror. Through the mirror. Show. Yeah, through the mirror. And yeah. yes, uh, because this was in 2002, uh, when this game came out, of course this game did not do very well. Uh, obviously because of the fact that a certain other game with Disney characters came out around the same time and clearly overshadowed this one. And, uh, wait, yep, what is this? Get Kingdom Heart. Uh-huh, and, uh, wait. Okay, that mirror, that arrow that just appeared there, I don't remember that being there. Hmm. That's the first time I've seen I that. Yeah, but as you guys have probably noticed, uh, instead of us controlling Mickey, we just pointed Mickey to a certain direction. Yeah, it's a point-and-click style game. A lot of people thought this was going to be a 3D platformer uh, based on the screenshots that were at, for this game around the time. And uh, I don't know if you guys... Well, I know Andrew obviously can't hear it, sadly, but... Um, but... Um... <laughs> oh god. <laughs> <laughs> now this is classic cartoon charm right here. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, this game is similar in the veins of Pac-Man 2 The New Adventures. If you guys have ever played that one. Hmm. But uh... I, but even though I know Andrew can't hear it, and it, he probably won't until the video goes up, but uh... But the uh, the voice, but the voice for Mickey is uh, this. This is uh, during a time when uh, the late Wayne Allwine was still the voice of Mickey, and he provides the voice here as well. May he rest yeah, in peace. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, him. Yeah, him and his uh, him and his uh, beloved wife, uh, Rusie Taylor. Yeah, the late Rusie Taylor. Yeah, I know. And it's hard to believe they actually got married in secret. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, hello. Yeah. Spooky. Yeah. That ghost, by the way, does not have a name. He's just literally referred to as mm. the ghost. So, what Let's is this? So, for those of you wondering what this is, this is a star holder. Now, no, it doesn't quite work in the same way as something like Mario 64 or anything like that. Because again, this isn't a, uh, a 3D platformer to begin with. Hmm, I... that door has a star! And no, the stars don't work as keys either. How do I know that? Well, because there's a key counter right Please. here. 
think of them as like a special move. Yeah, and there's that arrow again. I've never, again, this is the first time I'm seeing that arrow. Yeah, it might be like a glitch or something? I don't know. Ooh, ooh. But yeah. And, and. He has a key! <laughs> okay. Okay. And yes. Gotcha. Like this item get animation? Well, you better get used to it because he's going to be doing that for literally every item he comes across. Okay. And I think that's one of the reasons why people don't really like the game that much because of the repeat of animations. Well, there's that, but no, mm -hmm. well, I wouldn't say that because people could get used to it in something like Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask or basically any 3D Zelda game. Airplane, but it, it's just the lane of getting that item. Yeah. Well, well oh! the fact that, yeah, the fact that this, is, that this was marketed as a kid's game as well, I mean, to be fair, you could easily say the same thing about Kingdom Hearts, but... Even though it was rated T for teen. Was it? Yeah. Okay. I think the only one that first uh, Kingdom Hearts game to be rated with the something below T for T was the Game Boy Advance version of Chain of Memories. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember a lot of people did not Watch like this. that one. I thought it was okay, but... Uh... Yeah, it, the GBA version was better than ReChain, in my opinion. Yeah. And if you guys disagree with me, fight me! I, thought... I like the top-down vision better than the third-person vision of the main title games. Yeah, I, I can see that, well, it's for with sure. the battle aspect for the, for the... It's for the car battle aspect. Yeah. Hey, I, th I think I was doing. Uh, wait. What's going on? Oh, no. Oh. no! Oh, that's, uh... Yeah, that's not good. Yay! <laughs> you blasted ghost! And, uh, What? Wow! Squeeze me! So, here is the premise... Now, you'd think that that's the premise of the game. Well, it sort of is, but uh, you notice that I can examine the uh, pieces of the broken mirror here. Yep. Gee, what's this? I think it's just gonna be a nice if I'll put back together, maybe? Um... Oh, yeah, I spoke Yeah, about soon. that. Wow! No. Yeah. No. No, 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 no. Come back here. You guys are supposed to be flying. No. 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 What? what? Yeah. Let's just say that putting the putting the original mirror back together. Yeah. Of course, it's not going to be that simple. We yeah. wouldn't have because we wouldn't have a video game otherwise. No. <laughs> ah, great. They became Dragon Balls. Oh, what, so we get seven of them and we get a wish? <laughs> ah. Hmm. Easiest one to get, by the way. Because it's literally the next room over. I'm not even kidding about that. Yeah. Now, it's not going to tell us where literally every piece is going to go, because, uh, well, at this point, you obviously don't even know where most of these areas are. Exactly. The game is... Don't, I'm sure they'll probably show it in, like, kids mode. No. No, kids mode is not that elaborate either. Ah. Hmm. It is a little bit... It is a little bit more, but it doesn't tell you where every single piece is either. Well, for right now, let's see if we can find them pieces. Yeah. So that's basic... They're basically the main collectible of the game. <laughs> Ooh, a star! 
Yeah. Here we go. Okay. All right. First thing we gotta do. Hmm? A trick. A trick? I wanted a treat. Hey! Wow! That's not nice. Okay, that's one of. Okay, that's technically one of two ways to get the key. There technically is another way. So. Uh, aha! We got the key! Yeah. Again, get used to that pickup animation because that's not the last time we'll see it. Now, I think I have to. Yeah, just to. Now I have to leave and to get that uh, star uh, bit to, uh, well, I say star bit. <laughs> this isn't Mario Galaxy, sorry. Super Mario Galaxy! Uh, oh, it doesn't come back? Lame. But I was gonna say, I was gonna say that um, if, if I didn't activate the trick that was with that drawer, and if I try getting the trick... Okay, hold on. I have to... Well, first I have to see if, um... What? What? Okay, I thought that door needed the key. I guess not. I think it was the spiral door that needed the key. The... Wait, the spiral door? With the room... Back in the main hub. No, it's not. It, that's not how this game works, unfortunately. Uh, so I'll go I'll go back to the room with the mirror really quick just to show off what the blue spiral door is all about So this blue spiral door here yeah um, The reason that this door is here is because there are certain other places in this giant mirror mansion Yes, I said mirror mansion Oh great, we're playing Disney Mansion instead of Luigi's Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah. why don't we use a trick to get the mirror shard that's in there? Yeah. Huh? See, there's the mirror shard, Hello. but there's also a trick here. Eh. <laughs> 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 Yeah, by the way, if I didn't uh, if I didn't use the trick to get to get stuck in the drawer there, if I had used that trick instead, then that trick that I just did would have gotten, gotten the key as well. Yeah. So there are more than one there's so there's more than one way to get that key. But now that But now we have the very first mirror shard. In the best part, it goes to the mirror by itself. Yeah. No need to try to play some sort of puzzle mini game for it. Oh God, no. <laughs> okay, so we talked a little bit earlier about how you can actually link this game with the GBA port of the first Magical Quest. Which, by the way, it, in, in and of itself is very slightly different compared to its Super Nintendo counterpart. Yeah, it's more so, well, with the ability to play as many, the whole scrunch up screen. Well, yeah, I was about to say... Those mini games. Yeah, I was about to say, like, the biggest difference right off the bat was that you could play as many, which you could not do in the original game. Since it was, since Minnie didn't become a playable character in this series until the Great Circus Mystery. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> Hello. Ah, uh, uh, we can't, we can't get, we can't get to it just yet, though. We need to find a trick. Oh God, that stinger music! <laughs> oh, here we go. Uh, Mi Bye. Mickey. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, oh, come on. I have to do it again. Yeah, I yeah, think I have, to, I have to do I have to. He's going to do it again, isn't he? Yep. 
No, I he's not. He's trying to give you a helping hand. What? It doesn't what? have. Oh come on. Oh come on! Don't tell me it's just one and done. Lame. Oh my mm, god. Let's, let's go to another room first. Then. Yeah, let's go here first. Oh. Mhm. Mm we yeah. need the key. Yeah, we have a key. Find the key. Find the key. Find the key. <laughs> I need to rewatch that the original Honda Mansion movie before the new one comes out. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh the yeah the one with Eddie Murphy, right? Right. Yeah. Um. I'll be honest. When I first saw it, I didn't know how to feel about it. I was indifferent to it at first, but when I watched it again years later, um, I I grew to actually like it. It feels a little understandable when you know. When you know the fact of things are not going to be like the ride itself, right? Which I which I guess is what the newer version is going to try to do. Yeah. Well, well, we found the coin, but why did I mess with the piggy bank? Uh, I'll get to that. I'm not going to do anything with it, at least not just yet. Okay. You'll okay see. Here we go again. Uh, let's hope we do it again. Ah, there we go. Hello, ghosty. <laughs> there we go, there we go. I got it this time. And... Oh. Wait, let me go. <laughs> let me go. Let me go! <laughs> I swear. Ah, but wait a minute. What is this? Another mirror shard! Within the first 20 minutes of the game! Uh huh. Now, compared to something like, uh, like the games that I've been playing, uh, previously on the channel, this is going to be a little bit longer by in the tooth by comparison. Probably because yeah, okay. it's a point and click style game, but, uh, yeah. And in case anybody is wondering, yes, I do plan on getting every single piece of the mirror. It's because not... that's the only way to beat the game. Well, no, no, you can fill the mirror to a certain extent. But uh, I do think it's better to get every single piece as opposed to, uh, as opposed to just filling in enough. Oh, so yeah, you basically you get, get the, like, yeah, yeah, you also ending. yeah because you also get the best uh, ending that way. <laughs> uh, let me see. Hey, who turn off the light? Uh, no, 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 because I need, I need a certain. Certain. I need a sartan. Uh, what? Whoa. Easy there, GameCube. What happened? Uh, the graphics were getting a little bit fuzzy on me. I don't know why. Huh. It could very well just be the converter that I'm using, but uh, I don't know. Eh, who knows? Okay. Anyways, let's. We need to go over that way to get to that door there. Get this. Ah, another star. Yeah, there's a reason that I want to use that. I wanted to get that. Oh, because it may require two stars. Yes, certain certain tricks require more than one star. Reason why finding those star holders is very important. Indeed. So back in this room. Ah, we see a candle here. Let's As we mentioned earlier. Gee, watch oh? This. What? Ooh. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, it's a button mashing. I do love me button mashing. Uh. Uh, Mickey. <laughs> Spooky. 
Oh, there's another trick. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh! Hey. <laughs> hey, Mickey, what'd you find? Gotcha. Oh, that another coin! <laughs> ah, but what's this over here? Okay. It's a switch! Flick! Oh, the lava crunk! Oh, wait, wrong movie. <laughs> <laughs> the, you were on the right track for a good joke there. Oh, the switch, Mickey! <laughs> <laughs> I seriously love that movie, though. Indeed, very underrated. Yeah, it's it's yeah. It was definitely like during the during like the very tail end of uh, the Disney Renaissance. Yeah. Like I think yeah, I one think of the, the hmm? like yeah, because like after the Disney Millennium, as I want to call it. Yeah, because like. Yeah, and we obviously can't do anything with that key, unfortunately. At least not just yet. Yeah. Oh, and what is that over there? It's a dollar plush! Okay. Yeah, but you notice something very peculiar, uh, peculiar about it? It's... Uh... It's transparent. Oh! You know what that means? If it's transparent... <laughs> That means... Oh, star holder! Yeah, I see that too. Ding. Now we have three star holders. Yeah, I guess three star holders. Um, so, any item that you find in this area, in this uh, world, that's transparent, like the Donald plush, uh, uh, that means that if it you collect it and it disappears, that means that you will be able to see it in Mickey's actual room. Ah. Ah. Oh. Hello. Hmm. Remember that for later. Of course. It's going to become relevant. This one might be a little bit longer in the tooth as well, this first part. Okay. But it's okay. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, here we go. Our first twofer. What? Ah, but remember that mi mirror whoa, short? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here's mm -hmm. a one. Whee! Yep. Whee! <laughs> Wait, why did you grow him? Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, though. Why did you grow him just to shrink him? Eh. Fear of the short? I suppose. Oh, and by the way, if you ever want to stop him when he's moving, you you have to push the B button. While he's moving. Oh, and All the ball. Oh, this is, a, and this is basically mirroring another short. Ah, Mr. Mouse takes a trip. I once had a little oh. cat. Ooh. You like to go. Meow. Uh oh. Oh, yep. Oh, oh, here we go. Okay, seriously, what is with that arrow? I, I, I swear. I swear, folks, this is the first time that I'm seeing this arrow. Yeah, no, that was definitely what happened in Mr. Mouse Takes a Trip. I actually need to see the, the some of those shorts myself, because uh, some of them are really classic to me. Yeah, some of those shorts actually appeared in the uh, cartoon compilation film, uh, The Spirit oh. of Mickey. Ah. Ah, we're not done just yet. Hmm? Oh, no. Yeah, I remember, you saw the ghost. Ghosty. Oh no, it's a mimic! Oh god. This isn't Kingdom Kingdom Hearts called. They want their stick back. 
Sorry. No, it's Dungeons and Dragons. I don't think Mimic's ever appeared in that Kingdom Hearts. Oh, one more trick. One more trick. Wow. <laughs> Cartoon Ooh. logic. Ah, but in place of that, we have another, another star holder. holder. <laughs> I swear, this game is just making me laugh so much. Yeah, I, I definitely have a soft spot for this game because believe it or not, even though you know that I'm playing this on an actual GameCube, I could be using Dolphin. Um, and sure, it could run just as well. Um, but, um, I do have, like, an OG GameCube as well as a... Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Um, but I may as well do it this way since I have an OG GameCube, and we're going to ignore that plug for now. We're not going to do anything with it. Bottom, bottom, bottom. Yes. And back to the door. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you see that rubber ducky over there? Wait, 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 wait. Yes? Okay. I see the rubber ducky. Hmm? Oh? Wait, what? Um... Uh... <laughs> How did it get over... How did it get to the ceiling? <laughs> Don't also, ask that. Also, also, it's bouncing on its huh? own. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well, looking at you. Uh oh. Wank. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, this is not good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, I'd run. Ah, uh, there we go, there we go. Trick! Ah. Ah, the plug! A plug! And the mighty rubber ducky has fallen! <laughs> mm hmm. Good going, Mouse Boy. Got it. Uh, or not? <laughs> yeah, it's not going quietly. Ah, Time but... to fly an airplane. Yeah, remember that? Remember the plane from earlier? Yep. Fly, Mickey! Fly! Yep. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Come on, there we go. <laughs> That's Mario. <laughs> Mickey Mouse for Crimson Skies. <laughs> like seriously, if you've never played Crimson Skies, it trust me, it's definitely worth playing in my opinion. The one on the Xbox is really good. Like it's pretty much uh wait. Wait, what the? That's a that ghost! Wait. Oh! He went into that picture? Mickey should do, we can too! Hmm? Wait. Hmm. And the aspect changed! Yeah, um. Oh, oh it... by the way! Wham! Minigame! So, uh-huh, very much like a Mario Party game almost. So, this is the first minigame of the entire game, Mickey the Flying Ace. Go through the rainbows and your speed will be increased for a while. Shoot or avoid bubbles in your way. Can you reach the ghost in time? Collect stars to extend your time limit. So, you familiar with Star Fox? 
<laughs> oh, you better believe I'm familiar with Star Fox. Yeah, don't bother getting the rainbows. Just, just get the stars to increase your time limit. Trust me, it's worth it. Air. And of course, as you would expect, it play it plays very similarly to the original Star Fox. You just uh, go around shooting bubbles. Not really much of a threat. Frickin' bubbles! <laughs> uh. Well, that's our move quickly. Oh, you know, because I, I just uh, didn't get it all together, so that was my fault. I saw the star, like, move to the side. Well, it's not like getting... Well, it's not like how it is in getting health in, say, Muppet Monster Adventure on the PS1. Oh my god, I don't think a lot of people have played that one. It's a very underrated platformer, in my opinion. To be honest, the only Muppet game I actually played when I was a kid was, uh, that one NES game, uh, uh what was it called? Stopping at the Carnival? Mm, I don't know. Let me check. Because I remember playing it a good amount when I was a kid, but I did not know how it worked because I never got to the final boss. Oh, here we go. Muppet Adventure, Chaos at the Carnival. Oh, okay. Not so fast, Star uh, Mickey. Wait, no, wrong line. Unless you do that, Star uh, Mickey. <laughs> Let me try to get my piece pointed. <laughs> Let you do that, Star Mickey. <laughs> I am Jim Cummings. I am not. Yeah. Zero crashes. One rainbow. Twelve stars. Twelve stars. And full trick meter. Mm-hmm. Well, we only have oh. four, but uh, that's good enough. So yeah, we've done. Ah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. That that room where we saw the um, where we saw that uh, rocking horse. Well, first of all, there's a couple of other things to get here as well. Firstly, let's look in here. Ah? Mm -hmm. uh? Nope. Ah. Uh -uh. Aha. <laughs> A flashlight. That's gonna be useful. Mm-hmm. Much later. But let's also check out. Stop doing that shoulder buttons. Ah, but oh. that rocking horse. It's a two trick. <laughs> right, oh cowboy, Mickey. Ah. Oh, uh, did you see that? Hello! Hello! What is this? Another shard right off the bat! Alright! And that marks three within the first 40 minutes. Mm hmm. Sheens! Sparkle, sparkle. But yeah, um... Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, Muppet Monster Adventure, I thought, was a... It's a pretty decent game for what it is, because, um... Like, uh, it, it's pretty good for me to... I think it's a pretty decent game to play for, uh, for Halloween, I would think, given the setting of it all. If I can be honest, I feel like we should get more games that are similar to what uh, the this game and Pac-Man 2 the new adventures are, because it's kind of an ingenious idea, but if put into the right aspect, it could be like a pretty fun time. 
Wait, put the new wait, wait, to wait, 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 wait a minute. Pac-Man the New Adventures. That's the that's the Pac-Man point and click game. Yeah. Oh god, I remember. Oh god, I remember when some call me Johnny tried to stream that for uh for like the the charity stream that he was doing at the time. I bet it was it. Oh, he was having a miserable time. <laughs> well, that's because the fact that Pac-Man barely listens to you. Exactly. <laughs> Just the fact that he was having a miserable time makes it so hilarious. Also, bouncing on the bed gets you a trick. The key! Ha ha! Okay. Alright. There's nothing else to get in here, so we might as well move on to another area. Not the one with the piggy bank, because we still need... Okay, I'm gonna say this right now. For... for... to get what's in the piggy bank, we need three coins, and we only have two. We want money! Only one more coin. Money! And here's a silver star. Only fills up uh, most of the, uh... Of the, uh... Of the star. And ignore that painting of the Ice Mountain for now. We'll worry about that later. Yeah. Ah, uh, wait a second. First, let's go over here. Yes, because we know a mirror shard has to be around here somewhere. Mm-hmm. Ooh, a phonograph. No, it's a flower. The... Oh, I, I was about to say, what? <laughs> it looked like a phonograph. <laughs> Okay, I I do see it sort of. But that flower is going to be very important. Also, what is this Beauty and the Beast? Well, okay, to be fair, you do visit the uh the castle, like the Beast's castle setting in the Kingdom Hearts game, so that's kind of fair. Yeah. And it is a it Disney property, so it's again, it's fair. To be honest, my favorite actual level, actually, to be honest, within the Kingdom Hearts franchise. Ah, I see. Mainly with Kingdom Hearts, considering it's only appeared in Kingdom Hearts 2, mm. unless you want to count Kingdom Hearts Key, this is a tricky uh -huh. aka the Spe prologue game. Mm -hmm. Speaking of Key... Hello! Uh-oh. Time for a trick! Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, Mickey's got his head in a cookie jar! <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> oh, this hits close to home. <laughs> but in any case, we have another key. <laughs> yeah. Ah. But... All right. Oh. Okay. Wait, no, this feels like Peach's castle now. Ah, but wait a minute. Oh, 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 hello, hello. Okay. What's that underneath the stairs? What is that underneath the stairs? Uh -huh. uh Aha, -huh. good eye. Good eye, good on you. Hey, hey. We, we seem to have come across another star holder. Oh, perfect. Action. Five stars out of five. Oh, and by the way, oh, and by the way, because this is a Capcom game, yeah. Oh. Hi. Now what? I like to think that that's a funny homage to the original Resident Evil. Oh, I see. And, oh. uh oh, another trick! <laughs> uh oh. Oh, now, wait. Wait, now it's Clock Tower? That Which... wasn't even made by Capcom! Uh, the third one was. Oh, that's actually a nice fun fact. Well, it's... 
Well, it, well, okay. Technically, that's not the third game in the series, but it is called that. Clock Tower Three. Yeah. And it's be it's definitely better than the Struggle Within, or Clock Tower Ghost Head, which is what it was called in Japan. Yeah, just be glad that that wasn't the actual Scissor Man, Mickey. Yeah. Ah, but wait a yeah. minute. Where's oh, that shard? Oh. I saw it. Where is it? Where'd you go? Oh. Ah, there it is. Ah, ha, ha. Number four, right after the 40 minute mark. We're making great time. Uh huh. It's going to be a bit long in the tooth. In fact, I'm, I'd like to argue that every part is going to be at least an hour long or so. Eh, understandable. Considering what kind of game this is, it's not a... It's not like a traditional like 3D platformer like people were thinking it was going to be, but uh, I enjoy it for what it is, and I don't mind longer games, honestly. Yeah, same. I mean, hell. I went out of my like I went out of my way in the very first fable like uh like fable of the lost chapters in my case since that's the version I own ah. um I uh, it uh like I went out of my way to get pretty much a lot of the uh legendary weapons in that game and that's and that game is very long in the tooth No 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 Mickey that's not where I want you to go Sorry, pal. <laughs> I thought that's where you wanted me to go. Yeah, that's where I thought you were pointing. Okay. <laughs> ah, but this is where I want to go. Uh oh. What's in there, Mickey? Uh. Nothing of note oh, here. Buddy. Nothing of note. I I nothing of note here, I don't think. Oh. Hello. Yeah, shut up at Doomsgate. Sorry, that was my phone going off. And there was nothing in that suitcase. Ooh, look at that sword. Is that Excalibur? Mm, not quite. Hmm. What? What was that? But the sword. The sword fell out. Hmm. Um. Oh? Wait. What? A lightning oh, no. sword? Uh oh. Oh no. You ready for another Capcom Easter egg? Oh, which one are we referencing this time? Well, let me ask you this. What Capcom property uses a lightning sword? Uh, hmm. Oh, by the way, another minigame coming up. I've Avoid the flying one. sword. Don't get caught by the see. flying sword! Avoid the falling chairs and sofas! I wanna say, uh... I wanna say... It's, uh, Devil May Cry? Yeah, the very first one. Oh... Man, they put it... Two M-rated game references in a kid's game! Yeah... Capcom, you sly devils! Capcom's, Capcom loves their easter eggs, and I'm all for it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Run! Yo! It's okay, it's not the end of the world. Yeah, I just realized that the stars act as like a little health point for us. Uh, sort of. Hey! We made it! <laughs> oh, you little trickster. I swear we're not related. <laughs> Look, I know I'm called Trickster Fox, but my god. <laughs> and if you go out that same hallway... 
is very different. Yeah. It's straight on this time. Oh. Let's just get the server right now. After we got poked in the butt. Yeah. Alrighty. Okay. Oh. Wait. Is that... Mm -hmm. It looks like Cinderella. Uh, pretty close. Wait. Wait a second. Hmm. One has a flower and the other doesn't. I believe we can help her out. Wait a minute. Here you go, madame. This is for you. <laughs> Are you a honeysuckle? Oh, the... I'll go with it. It's a magical mirror, so... I guess magic is real here. About as real as it can be. Mm-hmm. Oh! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> what? Huh? Oh! We're not... Secret. We're not going that way just yet. Oh yeah, because of the second portrait moving earlier. A trick? Uh-oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh? Huh? Oh. oh. Is Mario about to hop out? <laughs> That'd be hilarious, but no. <laughs> ah! Oh god. Ursula? Oh, a key? We'll get that later. We'll get that later. You bloody... Oh, oh hello. Another twofer. Oh, <laughs> hmm? Shoes tied together? Wait. A what? Oh. It's Ninja McGee! <laughs> Mickey Mouse for Ani Musha. <laughs> That's another Capcom property, by the way. And by the way, we are not done after that ghost. <laughs> A lot of people <laughs> miss this. A lot of people miss this part. Get him! Where do you think you're going, Ghost Boy? <laughs> yeah, we're going stalker on your butt. Mm. Mm. Oh, time for another mm. Capcom reference, maybe. I don't know. That could be. <laughs> He's in that suit of armor, huh? Oh, I see the mace. Batter up! Ah, we're still not done. Get him! After that ghosty ghost! Gotcha! Off with ya! Alright, we're done with that. Now we're done for now. Not with the part, not with the part. We're not done there, but uh, we're just done with the ghost for now. Yeah, we still have, like, about 14 minutes left in the episode, I want to say. Yeah, we can go for a little bit longer. Well, let's go pick up those stars first. Yeah, I see them. But, yeah, so, uh, we have a... So, with the door from that one part in the foyer there, it was an obvious Easter egg to, uh... Uh, Resident Evil, the very first one. Yep. And I am talking... I am talking a little bit more about the, uh, the, the PS1 original, not so much the, uh, yeah. 
Not so much I the know, game, not so much the remake. Okay. And the sword was was an obvious Devil May Cry Easter egg. To be honest, I want to say that suit of armor was making me think of ghosts and goblins slash ghouls and goblins or ghouls and ghosts. I mean, eh. Ah, that's fair. Up, oh. oh, hello. And remember, I remember that key from earlier. Gotcha. One that we that the little ghosty ghost helped us get. Uh huh. Ah, and remember this? Yes, I remember. The fair lady let us through. Uh, hmm, uh, a little black in here. Oh, oh. That, okay, that's a little creepy. Ricky.exe, coming soon. Never, no, never again. <laughs> <laughs> ah, but wait a second. We have right, the flashlight. Uh... Ah, there we go, okay. Oh, ooh, we're in a cavern. Oh, I hear sh- Ah, what is this? Hey. Oh, another mirror piece. Oh, lucky, lucky. A little to the right. There we go. Got it. That's another piece. I believe that's the fourth one? Or is that the fifth one? I think that was number five, actually. Eh, we'll know soon enough. Yeah, yeah, it's the fifth one. I see the fourth piece. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, it... Yeah, we're making record time with these pieces. Indeed. I don't even know how many. I don't know how many pieces are are of the mirror altogether, but uh, whew. I wonder if it's okay. actually shown when it was flying all around us. But you fly too, so fast, it's hard to make sure you count them all without accidentally uh, miscounting. Yeah. Uh, oh! Wow! Oh, well, this reminds me of another Mickey short. Clock cleaners? Yep. Yeah. Uh, we can't do anything here yet, unfortunately. So, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, wow. because there's a certain item we need that we clearly don't have yet. Well, that stinks. It does, but not much we can do about that, unfortunately. So, hey, that blue spiral door. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum. No. Huh? Uh, that's not right. That... We'll just yeah. ignore. We'll just ignore it for now because it's not important. Yeah. Okay. That was weird, though. Very. Alrighty, so we're going to ignore these doors for now. Come on. Except for that door. Well, yeah, we we we. But remember, I said we need uh, at least one more coin for the piggy bank, so we can't, and we don't have that yet. So, uh, yeah, True. we'll we'll have to get that at a later time, I think. Alrighty. Now then. Let's get to the other side. Let's get to that other door, because I haven't gone through here yet. Yeah. Also. Oh. Four doors. Uh-huh. Well, this is a mansion. In the mirror. A mirror mansion, as you called it. Of course. Oh, another transparent oh. item. It's Minnie's bow. And because it's a transparent item, you know where this goes. Back to the real world. Mm-hmm. Oh. 
And what is this? Forks and knives! Forks and knives! Oh, oh. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, a little, tr little tricky to get it, but, uh... Wow. Well, it's called a trick for a reason. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, no! They're going so short our apprentice! <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> now Mickey's going so short our apprentice! Uh, uh, wait a second. Okay. What is that? It's another mirror piece. Piece number six. And within the first hour, six pieces. Holy crap. We are making record time with this game. I'm not mm -hmm. even sure how many playthroughs I've seen where people did not get this many this already. The fact that it was at an angle where we saw Mickey slept. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, 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 I see that Donald plush. Yee! Right there. I see it. Alrighty. Now, what is here? Another oh. trick. And we have enough for it. Ah. Oh no, the cookie jar! <laughs> oh, no, that's the flower jar. Uh, yeah, close enough. Oh, look at that! Hello! It's a lemon! Ah. Oh, it's a coin! Yeah, wait, what did you think it was? A lemon. It was because of the angle it was at. It looked like a lemon slice. Oh, I see. I'm also a lemon wedge rather than a lemon... Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, because it's yellow as well. I see. Yeah. Plus with the design of the coin, it made me, made it look like a lemon. I'm sure when you edit this, you're going to see it as well. Yeah, I see it. I, I, do, I did sort of see it. Also, speaking of lemon, uh, you you've seen that uh, Bill and that uh, that one clip of the Bill and Ted cartoon that uh, uh, <laughs> the the what colors in orange uh, clip going around. Oh my god! I don't think I have yet. Like it's a uh, like I'm I'm sure you've I'm sure you've seen it, uh, people use it and whatnot, but uh, but um. Yeah, we have enough for ham. Yes, that's just ham from Toy Story. Does look like it. Hmm. This is a oh, and you see what's inside? A gear. Hmm. Ah, we have coins. Uh huh. <laughs> oh. oh. I thought that was Goemon's thing. <laughs> Speaking of Goemon, he's in—he's uh, <laughs> finally a playable. I, I already mentioned this in the Discord chat, but he's—he's uh, he's a playable character in uh, Smash Remix. You have mentioned that. Uh huh. Yeah. What really got me, believe it or not, in that trailer was. Uh, Slippy and Peppy as playable characters. Like, oh, good <laughs> lord. Yeah, that... Yeah, that surprised me. I was like, wait, what? I thought Crystal... I thought it was gonna be Crystal. I don't think a lot of people remember Crystal nowadays since she has been practically forgotten. Such a shame. Such a shame. That's... And that's really a shame, too, that... Uh, that Star Fox Assault especially does not get that much love. And that's my favorite of the uh, of the actual Star Fox games. 
And I believe that was actually the final one. Uh, no, no, the final rare game that was released for GameCube was Star Fox Adventure. Which yeah. Which introduced this one. Yeah. Which was originally going to be a game for a Nintendo 64, but it got pushed back. Then the whole Microsoft acquisition happened, so yeah. Like, I do think it also makes sense to say that, um... Wait, hold on, hold on. Let me check my items and make sure I got that gear. Yes, I got the gear. I saw the animation. Okay, okay. I, I was just making sure because I, I kind of forgot about it. Okay. Huh. Yeah, let's fill up on the stars. But yeah, uh, the Bill and Ted uh, clip that I was talking about, uh, I don't know what episode it is of the animated series because that's what it is. Uh, the, that's where it's from, Mickey. Thank you. Uh, but um, Bill and Ted are on this uh, pirate ship. They're swabbing the deck, literally. And uh, yeah, yeah, because it, yeah, because it gets to that uh, clock tower area. All right. But yeah, um, it starts out with uh, Bill and Ted literally um, swabbing the deck of a pirate ship, I think. I think, and then and then and then and then Ted goes, uh, and then and then Ted goes, Bill, I just have one question for you. What is it, Ted? What color is an orange? Ted, you bonehead. The color, the color's the same as its name. Name, just like a lemon. <laughs> and what's even and you know what's even better what in the animated series uh the voices of bill and ted are actually by the same actors from the movies which is pretty funny like, like, so you're saying before toy story 4 keanu reeves actually had done some voice acting yeah with a character he's already familiar with. Excellent! <laughs> <laughs> I had to reference it. Yeah, I know. It like it is honestly pretty cool that they actually got uh, the actors, uh, both Keanu Reeves and uh, I can't remember the name of the actor who plays Bill, but uh, they actually got them to reprise their roles in cartoon form. That's actually pretty cool to me. Agree. It's always awesome when the original voice actors do return for spin-off projects. Yeah, uh, I think uh, like the actors for the Clerks movies did the same thing with the short-lived animated series. Yeah. In for the uh, pilot movie for Spuds Lightyear of Star Command, they did bring in Tim Mallon, mm. but when it became the three-parter episode, they brought in Patrick Warburton. Yeah, yeah, that's it true. It would go on for a play buzz for the series. <laughs> yeah. I feel like Patrick Warburton is, like, one of Disney's main go-to voice actors. Patrick Warburton? Yeah, I mean, wow. Gronk, Buzz Lightyear, Professor Barkin from Kim Possible. Wait, that was him? Yeah! You I... did not know that? No, I actually didn't know he that. He used to play voice for all the nearly all the characters he voiced. Hey, to be fair, it's been a while since I last saw Kim Possible. Okay, <laughs> so cut me some slack. Okay. Hmm. Uh, Mickey. Uh, there we go. One, two, three. Oh, Who does he think he is, Lara Croft? Oh, if only. <laughs> well, I mean, she did... Well, I mean, apparently she was able to cross over with Raziel from uh, Soul Reaver. And that is a... Hello? And another mirror shard. What about that? Hey Mario, somebody's trying to steal your shit. Uh, somebody's trying to steal my shit. How dare they? Well, I don't know about that, Mario. You got rid of the peace sign. Oh, 
Well, that, that is a fair point. Yeah, I was gonna say, because Shigeru Miyamoto didn't like it. <laughs> well, Papa Miyamoto did uh, really change on my aspect so many times. Especially with that new Wonder game coming out later this year. What? Oh, Super Mario Brothers Wonder. Okay, I was, I didn't know what you were talking about for a second there. <laughs> I can't believe you forgot about that, especially with the elephant in the room. <laughs> okay, I walked into that one. <laughs> oh, beca because, uh, because... I guess you could say I was barking up the wrong trunk. I'll be here all week. Actually, no, I won't. <laughs> yep. Yeah, yeah. All right. Now we're going outside really quick. Nothing of note here. Up. Oh, wait a minute. I see Hello. something. I think I see something blinking over there. Oh, it's another key. Fun key. Fun key. Fun key. Gotcha. Yeah. Also, look at the. Also, look at the background of this area. Well, once you see it again. Like, look at th look at the stuff in the background. That is amazing. Capcom really outdid themselves. Yeah, that just looks that like that whole landscape looks absolutely gorgeous. Like, I I I I am not joking. That looks that that just looks beautiful. Like I said, Capcom really went all out at times. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, wait a minute, what is this? Another trick? <laughs> <laughs> nope! <Yoink. laughs> uh, ooh. Oh, oh, oh god! Oh, ooh! <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Can't get away with that nowadays in some G Disney games. No, unfortunately not. Oh! No, we're not doing the trick this time. Because it does that eventually anyway. Okay. Oh! One, two, three, four. Ah, one hour off. Hmm. By the way, that area with the bell. That's the other part of the mansion. We can't get I to know. it. We're not going to get to it right now. You I notice that? About the... Yeah, because the star holder is there, and the only way to get it down is if I do a certain thing. We're oh. not going to. We're not going to do that trick just yet. Oh. oh, oh, oh. You know, I'd say Curiosity killed the cat, but, uh... But he's a mouse. Yeah. So I guess in this case, it's going to kill the mouse. Because the gap is... Because that gap is a lie. Just like the cheesecake. <laughs> Wrong game! I know, but I had to go for it. It's okay. It's okay, Mickey. It didn't work for Travis either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that brings back memories. Uh huh. Okay. Wait. What? It's still up there? I uh think the trick house extends it. Oh. Okay. So I have to do the. So I have to do the trick. Not yeah, no, not yeah. the not the trick with the clock tower, but um, the one with the clock itself. Well, no, because, well, well, I guess I don't know. 
And here we go again. Yeah, I have to do it. I, yeah, to do this again, I have to do the trick. Yep, so, um. Ready to fast forward? Yeah. Yeah, I think this is where we fast forward. Fast forward! Fast forward, Xer! Hey, Andrew, I'm gonna fast forward this anyway. <laughs> Still, it'd be better if we get uh, the fast forwarding uh, speak voices. I felt like that was gonna be perfect, anyhow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. All right. No. To write the trick. No. No, because it doesn't do anything. Yes, it does. Yeah, I'll, see, I'll show you what I mean. Besides, I don't have it. Ah, see? Oh, now it's four o'clock. Uh, almost. Oh, oh, wait a minute. If we go again, it'll be five o'clock. I know, but the thing is, uh, I don't even have enough stars to get it all the way to 12. Two. Okay, so I, w I guess I will do the trick this time. For w with the pole. With the pole that Mickey holds on to. Okay. Uh, if no. the game, well, if the game allows me to. I don't know if it will. Because I, oh, I might have screwed myself over by uh, accidentally... Uh, It's falling over the edge immediately. Yeah. Well, that wasn't a trick, but, uh, but, uh, yeah, you know what I mean. I think we can just, like, click the uh, pole can and... I... Oh, oh, I have to click that first. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. oh I have just enough. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, gosh. oh boy. Oh, at least Mickey has it. We're not getting that star holder, unfortunately. We'll probably get it at the next part. <coughs> oh god. You all right there? I choked on a piece of meat. <gasps> oh God! No, literally, like a little itty bitty piece of meat. Okay. Ugh. Hello, what is this? It's another transparent <laughs> item. Ah! Hit me with ya. Mm-hmm. Uh, yes, thank you. Oh, and by the way, if you try examining the uh, the rope that Mickey did the trapeze act on, um... Oh, no, yeah. oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. So we can't go back that way, unfortunately. Yeah. And look at that! Another mirror piece! But how are we going to get it? We can't jump that high. No, unfortunately not. Hmm? The thing is, though, I know the trick for this. So, you notice how he's just running down the stairs? Yes. Well, what happens if we go back up those stairs? Mash the button! I'm mashing! I'm mashing! Oh! 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 
And gotcha. got it. Piece number seven, I think. Wow! Or is it eight? I believe it's seven, actually. Okay. Sheesh, I think this is going to be a short series. If we're finding pieces like this. Okay, that's got to be a big chunk then. Like that, like the piece I just got has to be a big chunk of the mirror. Wait. Oh yeah, it's a very big piece. <laughs> ah, We're almost you know, done. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, but wait a minute. Oh. Hello. We have enough. We, got... we have enough pieces to get back, but we're not gonna do that. No. No. I said I was gonna get every single piece. And no, I'm not going back up. I'm not going back up the stairs. There's no reason to go back up there now. Yeah. Now, let's see, what is over here? Hello, what is this? Another transparent item. What could it be? Oh, it it's the mansion. Ooh, nice. Could it be well with ya? Let's go get them stars. Hmm, I wonder what's in the prison cell over there. Well, it's not... It's not really a prison cell, it's more, uh, basement. Okay. Boy, I thought this is the law drinking. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hmm. Unless those are root beer barrels. Hmm. A, a basement full of barrels, that's, uh, interesting. Mm -hmm. If a gorilla comes out, Nintendo may want a word about to Capcom. I suppose. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing interesting about barrels. Uh, I'll let you ask about it. Uh oh. What? Uh oh. Barrel tipped over. Ouch! Uh... Um... <laughs> Ouch! Mickey? Wait, the fighting music is playing again? Come on. Wait a minute. Oh. Wait a, oh, Mickey, wait wait a like second. Ryu. I was about to say, I noticed that fighting pose. That is Ryu. Round three, fight! So, ready for another Capcom Easter egg? Oh, we got more Street Fighter! Punch the rolling barrels. Press A to make Mickey punch upward. Hold the button for a little while and then release it for a special surprise. Oh! It... Ah. Oh, Duncan! A Duncan! <laughs> Ding so? ah. A Duncan! A Duncan! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Okay. Oh. No, no! Oh! Well, at least it jumped over him. A token! I was supposed to wait that one out. Ah! Uh, token! Ding cool! A token! A token! There we go. Four out of five's not bad. Yeah. 80%! Eh, 
and a good fill up of the star meter. Mm -hmm. So that's three Capcom references so far. First Resident Evil, then Devil May Cry, and now Street Fighter. Well, at least with Street Fighter, it was like rated uh, K through A at the time, I want to say. Yeah, and... Oi! Uh, really? An empty tomato can, really? Are you really that desperate? I'll show you. Man, you need to play more Street Fighter. Yeah, or at least Master the Satsui no Hado. I was making a reference to the game uh, True Crime Streets of LA, by the way. That's the thing that the main character says. And no, that's not a cap. And no, that's not a. And no, that is not a Capcom game either. It's just a funny little uh, name drop, I guess. But yeah, we have a new item, the empty tomato can. It's going to be relevant a little later. Meanwhile, uh, let's see, where is it? Okay, I can't go that way. Open the door, get on the floor. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Wait, Ooh. what's here? Open salami! <laughs> hey, more stars! That we don't need, because I'm already full. What is up with that strange... Oh. Hello! A transparent item! After you were clicking the other items! Uh-huh. Gotcha! Aha! Oh, and it's a picker! Oh, thank you! Yeah, it's a picture of Mickey and the gang. Nice. I like that. And I noticed that star holder. Wait, what? Excuse me? Uh, okay, how do I get over there? Okay, there we go. Ding dong. <laughs> ah, that makes number six. Yeah, by the way, uh, something you might not notice, but... Uh, this game runs at 60 frames per second. And this is a GameCube game. Well, certain games were able to do that during this time. Like, uh, I know Star Fox Adventure is a game that we were talking about does that too. Uh, for one thing, it's made by Rare, so... Yeah, I mean, Rare was always known for pushing the hardware. Mm hmm. Okay, not Hi. much, uh, not much else here. It looks like. Yeah, especially since uh, that loose floor tile's not doing anything for us. Wait, what? Okay. Oh. Hello. Ooh, oh. that looks that looks like a long way down. I'm not going that way. Um, hmm. But we'll make it. Had to build his, <laughs> had to build his confidence up. That's always nice. Yep. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Oh, oh. Hello there, Mr. Pole. Gee, what's this? Uh, it's a pole, Mickey. Hmm. Wonder what I do. Trick. Yes. Ah, I think I see what to do here. <laughs> uh -huh. Hot dog. Ready? Oh God, this music playing right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I remember seeing a blade through this, but I forgot the music. But I believe it was like some sort of heroic type of music. Yeah. Oh, I noticed something up there. Huh? It's very- it was very brief, but you'll probably see it if I ever get there. Three. And, and I two. say- and yes, I do say if. Charge! Uh, 
Not, not quite. Book. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, because you wouldn't be able to access this room otherwise, so I had to do it this way. And hello, I... what is in there? What's this? Could it be? Uh, can I not you Gotta get... get to the edge of the... Oh, okay, go. I see. Well, hello there, Miss... The Star Holder. Mm. Uh, it's literally right in front of you, Mickey. Mm. It, it's literally right here. Hmm. Look. Now, how is he gonna get to get it? I don't know. Well, wait a minute. Uh, oh. oh! We need lame. to get an extra smile. That's lame. I didn't know this was a three fur. Can I? Can I not? There we go. Mm -hmm. All right, that's fine. No stars in the room. No, no stars in the room, unfortunately. Oh, that sinks. That it does. Okay. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Hmm. Well, unfortunately, that does mean that I have to go to another room mm -hmm. to get more stars. I mean. Uh, Mickey. Uh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Mickey, you utter fool. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, that was close. That was close. That was close. <laughs> Cartoon logic. <laughs> yeah, it was trying to steal Bugs Bunny shtick. Well, Mickey has been around for as long as Bugs, so, uh. Yeah, they have team up once or twice. Oh, yeah, who framed Roger Rabbit? It was two for the poll, right? What? It was two for the poll, correct? Oh, we need one more star. Uh, we're not going to that room again this time. Okay. Like, as much as I want to get that star holder, I can't do it right now. Because uh, cause even then, I won't have a, I won't have enough to get there. Uh, there were two silver stars in the room over there. Yeah, but that wouldn't fill up the... Uh, I don't think that'd be enough. Or maybe it would be enough. I don't know. But, it was uh, two for the pole. I think it was one for the F. Was it two? Okay. Yeah. Let's 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 just. But there. But I did see some. But the thing is, I did see something up that staircase. So I want to get what that is. Okay. You can just. Okay, so it's oh, one. Oh, it's one for the pole. We're not going to do the trick this time. Well, not not for the one that knocks me into that room. And then the Space Jam-esque music again. I guess. I don't know. I wouldn't say it's Space Jam-esque, because it's nothing like that, but you know what I mean. Yeah. By the way, speaking of which, have, have you ever played, like, the Space Jam game? The original Super Nintendo game? Oh, well, PS1. Uh, it, I believe it, but there was also a version on Super Nintendo, but... Well, I there was a... Yeah, there was a, Well, there was a basketball game with Looney Tune characters on the Super Nintendo, but it wasn't that. Oh my god, you actually did have enough. Because it was one for the tip-over. Yeah, but... <gasps> yeah, but I also wanted to get up here and see what was up there. Ah! 
Oh, hello! Another star holder! Mm hmm. Alrighty. Let's Just get the star the holder. Seven. Yep. And we started the second row. Uh-huh. Now can I no, I sadly can't go back down, unfortunately. Oh that stinks. A little lame. Wait, what's here? Ah, oh, the bookshelf! Or, like, the, the library. Okay. And what is this? It looks hmm, to be... a magnifying glass! <laughs> By the way, if you ever need one, I have one handy. I don't remember which yeah. video. I don't remember what video it was, but uh, where you said you needed one. But uh, hmm? but uh, I'm just saying. Hello. There's a key up there. Hmm. How do we How get do we to get it there? though? Oh, Wait, a trick. trick. This is definitely going to be a treat. <laughs> or wow. not. Or not. That's not nice. <laughs> no, it is not. <laughs> oh, I think I remember what's gonna happen here. I have to pick which uh, book mm. case it is. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's this one right here. Can I examine it? It's this one. Shakey shakey shake. Wow. <laughs> Here uh, he goes he's, again. Uh, but he's not done. Mm. Which oh, the kid. God, that time we saw it. Yeah. Shake it, shake. <laughs> wow. That's two. One more. <laughs> nope, he's done. Aww. Think about breaking Nintendo's rule of three. <laughs> Anyways, I don't think there's much else we can do here unless there's another door I didn't see. Hmm. Okay. Uh, there was the blue door I think I saw. Yeah, but uh, that's not the door I was talking about. Um, bum, 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 bum. I think that's that door. Oh wait, there's two doors. Okay. Uh huh. Wait, I think this is the door I came from. Oh, no it's not, because this one needs a key. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Use the key, use the key, use the key! Hey! Alrighty. Some instruments. Hmm. Can I? Well, I, I probably can, but uh, there's something I need to get first. Oh? Yeah. Y you'll see what I mean in a little bit. Ah, wait a minute, what is this? Another transparent item? And it's yeah. a windmill? 
Ooh. Yeah, it's a windmill. Ooh, nice. Back to the real world with you. Nope, can't do anything with that. Hello. It's a mini ghost. Hmm? <laughs> oh. Well, about that, Mickey. Uh, uh. <laughs> Now it's you who's now it's you who shrunk. Oh god, the athletic music again? Imagine it was Rocky Balboa music. Oh, the... No, oh, the, the montage music? Yeah. Da -da -da, da -da -da. <laughs> Uh-oh, uh uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> he saw that coming! Uh, uh, <laughs> ah, wait a minute. What's that? Oh, hello! An RP! It's another shard! Yeah, we can't get to it right now, unfortunately. Well, not yet. Since we're still shrunk. <laughs> and now we are normal size. Once again. Oh. Hello. Oh. Oof. All right. Let's get that shard it's... since it's here. I believe this marks on uh, number nine. I suppose so. Wow, we are doing this in record time as well. Like, and this is just the first part. As long as it is. Imagine if we just finished the game off in just this week alone. Oh god. <laughs> Short game. <laughs> ah, it's another big piece. Well, big enough. Oh, oh, oh. I think there's just one more piece left then. Of the right side anyway. Oh, and there I might and I think and I think there might actually be no, one wait, or no, two more pieces over. on the left though. Um, go, there we go. Ah, speaking of which, you were talking about that uh, electric guitar earlier. I was speaking about the instruments in general. Oh, oh we have enough! Huh? Oh? Is amazing. <laughs> Indeed, it is amazing. <laughs> and by the way, another More? mini game, Mickey the Guitar Master. 
Move the pick left and right to catch the stars that are coming down. If you press A, when you catch a spinning star, then you'll get a special point. One, two, three. Uh oh. Oh, great, we're playing Guitar Hero now. Close enough. And no, I can't use the D-pad either. I, I believe this actually came out before the first uh, Guitar Hero came out. I was always better at drums than I was at uh, guitar in uh, Rock Band. Yeah. Well, Rock Band 2, because that's the game I had. I never really owned any of those games in general. But my cousin actually used to have a uh, Rock Band. Only had the drums and guitars, though. Whew. Oh, oh, I think you got them all! And on the first go. Let's go! <laughs> yeah, zero misses. Oh, that's gotta fill them all up. What can I say? I am a professional, and what is with that arrow? I don't know, but... I don't know, I don't... I, I don't care. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow! Ah, but that was fun. Agreed. Mm, what's behind door number one? Which we need to unlock with a key. And even though when we got shrunk, you thought we lost that magnifying glass, we didn't. I know. See? Still there. I know. Hello, what is this over here? He's a remote! Gee, watch this. It's a, t it's a TV remote. Uh... I would think. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure iPhones did not exist in 2002. I know, reason why I said it's a remote. <laughs> okay. And just a little chair we can just lounge around in. <laughs> or is it? Yeah, just take a little snooze, why not? <sighs> oh. Hello. Uh. Um. Let me be in the tree. Oh <laughs> shoot! Oof! I don't think that's a bee. I think that's a wasp. Uh oh. Ding ding. Mickey! Yeah, now's not the time to snooze. Three, two... <laughs> yeah, you kind of have to help guide the wasp. Or the... Or this guy, or the bee, I guess. I don't, I don't know, is it a bee or is it a wasp? I would say it's a bee, more likely. Okay. But yeah, you do have to kind of guide him towards Mickey. Oh! Ooh, the jazz and music going on. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh 
Show me what you got. Ah, uh, hello. Ooh, bear piece. This is piece number 10, if I recall. Nine or nine. Ugh. No, I no, no. Wait, no, 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 no. It is 10. Uh, which means there's probably 12 in total. Or 13, because I think the left side may have uh, three pieces. Uh, we'll see once we, the mirror shard lands. Yeah. Into the mirror! And what did- Oh, there we go! The final piece of the right side. Now we just need the two pieces of the right, left. Unless it's three, because I think one of them might actually be a very small piece that makes you think it'll be a big uh, piece, but it's not. But, oh! Yeah, it tricks you like that. Okay. Um, bum, bum, bum. Oh, and we need another key. Thankfully, I've got one. We have three. Oh, we have two. Oh, oh this so room. Oh. oh, time for some Scooby Doo stuff. Oh, uh, speaking of which, uh, something that I actually wanted to bring up, uh, you remember I talked about, uh, Quentin Flynn being the voice mm -hmm. of, uh, Sir Henry in the very first, uh, No More Heroes. Yes. And he, and of course he reprises the character in, uh, in No More Heroes 2, but not No More Heroes 3. Yeah, that surprised me. Oh, what no. the? Oh no. We're doing this oh. again. I don't know which one it is. It's always randomized each time, I think. Well, each time that this happens. Okay, I know this is the real Mickey. So don't don't ever pick this one, because this is the real Mickey. Let's go with him. I think I know what this is implying, too. Ah, there was a weak spot. Yeah. You know what they say, keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Indeed. Ah, here we are. Another star holder, how about that? Thank you, mysterious embodiment of whoever's helping us through the mansion. This is star number eight, I believe. Yeah, it is. Yep. Get a six on top. Ah, oh, this a one door needs that a key. needs a door that needs yet another key. Mm -hmm. And luckily enough, we have one. Mm -hmm. well, technically two, but now we have one. Now, where does this take me? I wonder. Hmm. Ah, what is this? Well, first let's go over here. It's a stool. Yes. Ah, and there's a key up there. Oh. How are we gonna get up there? Ha! We need the stool, of course. Ah, but he's not tall enough. He's not tall enough. Ain't that the truth? But there's another stool. Uh huh. Hmm. Place it on the other stool. Hmm. Of course, Miss hmm. Mr. Fox. Hmm. Now we should be able to get the key. There we go. Now try it. 
Yeah, he has a bit of a better chance now. Indeed. Oh, easy. Easy does it. Uh oh. Whew, that was close. Way too close. Whew. And he got it! Another key. Gotcha. Now, the biggest problem is I don't know which door I use to get in. And it wasn't this one, because I need a key for this one. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a good thing I got the key I just got, then. <laughs> Indeed. It's like, hey, you probably have no more keys on hand. Here, take this free key. <laughs> ah, wait a minute. Hello! You have tiny little holes! Yeah, we can't do anything with them right now, unfortunately. But... Yeah, we gotta get tiny again somehow. No. No, you'd think, but no. Okay, seriously, how do I... I was about to say, how do I get downstairs? Yeah, I believe you have to click the stairs! <laughs> Another key? <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> that... And I believe that might be the last key we need to use. Well, for now. Unless there's another one that I need to get to that I can't. Wait. We're back in the kitchen? We went right around. In a huge circle. I never, but, by the way, we didn't check the fridge. The fridge? Yeah, I think there might... We should see if there's anything in the fridge. All right, let's go take a look. Hmm? Nope. There's Ooh. not a single thing in that hmm. fridge. Hmm? Huh. We can't even check the freezer, can we? No, unfortunately not. Jeez, what is it up with cartoons never checking okay. the freezer? After checking the fridge. I don't know. Like, I feel like that happened so many times in old cartoons. Yeah, there was like also that, uh... Yeah, yeah. and... Yeah, also, also, by the way, another star holder. Hey! But yeah, it's Number like a... Uh, yeah. Ah, but wait a minute, what is this? Hmm. Oh? No, we're not doing that trick. We are doing this one, though. Oh? Be your guest! Opening the window. Methinks it be tea time. One lump or two? Uh, I don't know. For some reason, seeing that just makes me think of Sword in the Stone. Oh, yeah. I, I really love that movie. I do. Yeah, despite the fact the voice actor went through pu- or the war went through puberty. Yeah, he had to get several different voice actors. And yes, we're doing this again. But this time... Not this one. Ah, but this one only needs one this time. Hmm. Opening the window again, because it is tea time again! But the question is, why does it need one star now? Uh, uh, probably because we already did the trick. I I suppose. Wait. Oh, what was that? Excuse me. 
That was different. <gasps> it's the ghosty. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> the look on his face is priceless. <laughs> Indeed. I'm okay. Yeah, you're fine. I don't think we get anything else from that, so, uh, no more time for tea, unfortunately. Oh. So, clean cup, clean cup, move down! <laughs> clean cup, clean cup, move down, move down, clean cup, clean cup, move down, move down. <laughs> Anyways, let's, uh, well, well, we'll get those stars later. But, uh, remember that painting that I said would be relevant later? At uh, the snow mountain? Yes. Well, first let's get the star since it's there. Okay. Oh. You noticed it too, right? Yeah, it looks like a little door. Hmm? You're right, Mickey. Right. Look a little closer. Now move oh. down. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Back to the left. Hey, oh. Get back over there. Hmm? The fridge! What? Wait a minute. We saw a fridge earlier, didn't we? Yeah. But we will resolve that a little later. A little later. Don't worry. I'll resolve oh. it just... No. I will resolve it. Actually, wait a minute. What is this? Oh. Wow. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> dude, we, dude, we, clear, we clearly saw you. Yeah. <laughs> tickle, 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 tickle. Did it? Surprise! <laughs> See ya, buddy. Wait, what did he drop? It looks like another mirror shard. Is it? Yes, it is. And I'll be done. Wee. This is actually the last shard. This was a short playthrough. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't think this is the last one. That's a pretty big gap to fill. Remember that middle piece? Yeah, we got- I got a middle piece. Yeah, see? Oh... There's actually two pieces left now. So it's not 12. I know for a fact that the that the piece that's uh, sticking inwards more is uh, is a smaller piece. That's how I know that. Anyways, let's go to Zisa this hallway. I almost said this room, but same difference, I suppose. Get back in here. Ah, we're back here, huh? Mm-hmm. Open the door. Ah, what is this? Oh, well, um, I, I know what this is, but... Oh! Mm -hmm. Think. Oh, wait a minute, we need to plug in the TV. As remember earlier, 
Mm-hmm. Ah, but wait a minute, what is this? E remote? What? Uh-oh. <laughs> 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 I'm okay. Ah, but wait a minute, let's check the TV again. Mickey! You're too big. You're common sense, Mickey. I'm okay. I believe we know a way of getting shorter. Yes, we do. Let's go see our good witchy friend. Mm-hmm. By the way, small fun fact for people who don't know. In the Donald Duck short trick or treat, the witch's name is Hazel. I remember that short. And believe it or not, the voice for Witch Hazel, it's the same as Looney Tunes Witch Hazel. Oh god, the same voice actor. Really? Yep. But yeah, I actually do remember that uh, that short because it was fe I think it was the short, the first short that was featured in uh, I think what was it, House of Mouse Villains? I think it was. Mickey's House of Villains. I believe it was the first one as well, but I don't remember. Yeah, yeah because I, I remember. Yeah, because I remember that short vividly. I remember that short pretty well. And it's like one of the only Halloween shorts that I tend to watch during the Halloween season. Yeah, same here. Mainly because of the song. Yeah. Drink a drink for Halloween. All aboard! Yeah, we're not doing the suitcase thing again. Yeah, we are done with the mimic. But yeah, um... Actually, one of the funniest things about... I think probably my one of my personal favorite... Uh, Donald Duck shorts, believe it or not, was, uh, it was a more recent one, um, well, I say recent, but it's not really all that recent, unfortunately. It um, was from Mickey Mouse Works, right? Yes. Yeah, uh, to me it was, uh, because I had remembered seeing a, uh, a YouTube poop based on that short. Ah. And, uh, I think the, 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 uh, I think the short was, uh, the short, the original short is called Computer Dot Dawn, but the, but the, uh, YouTube poop was, was just called Donald Gets a Computer. Yeah, and that's one of the reasons why I'm hoping somewhere down the road, uh, Disney adds out some mouse to Disney Plus, because if they're not going to add in the Mickey Mouse Works cartoons for their shorts area, they should at least put in the House of Mouse series. Yeah, like, uh, I really enjoy it for what it is. And we're- oh, don't tell me we're gonna do the rubber duck thing again, though. No. Yes, we are. Uh, hmm? Yep. We're not gonna but do we the- won't... we're not gonna do the plane trick again, though, unfortunately. Yeah, we're just gonna run from the duck. Oh. Yeah, we unfortunately. Yeah, I'm not gonna make us sit through this again, but I can't skip it either. So, when you're editing, pass forward. Of course. Run, run, you fool, run! Run for your life! We're not gonna do the trick again, though. Not this time. Sorry, Mickey. Hey, you're about to get squashed by a duck. Help me! Help me! Oh! 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 That 
just brings back memories of Through the Mirror cartoon. <laughs> Anyways. Well, oh, I guess the duck is nowhere to be seen now. Oh, yes, it is. He's on the track. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyways, uh, Computer Dot Dawn, the short that I was, th the short that I actually really enjoy, from I think it's from Mickey Mouse Works, because considering when it came yeah, out, yeah, because House of Mouse was like a redistribution, or like both classic and Mickey Mouse Work cartoons. Yeah. Also. Um, hmm. Also, I think, uh, I mean, it's not the exact short, but, uh, yeah, we're gonna, okay, now we, yeah, now it works. Yay! Hey, here's the cartoon in question. Uh-huh. Wow. But not computer.dom, but through the mirror. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, um, it's not even the exact short in question, but, uh, but uh, I know there was the one short, uh, because I was talking about Quentin Flynn a little bit earlier. I was talking about how he was the voice of Sir Henry from uh, No More Heroes, as well as uh, the voice of Axel from Kingdom Hearts. Yep. Uh, I got that memorized. Yeah. And uh, he was also the he, he also voiced, uh, of course, Raiden from the Metal Gear Solid uh, entries. As well as yeah. Metal Gear, and yes, he even reprised his role for Metal Gear Rising. And uh, I believe, um, I don't remember the name of the short in question, but it's the one where Mickey, or uh, well, not Mickey, but uh, Minnie takes care of Pluto. Um, really? That's excellent. Uh, that's the one time he, yeah, that's the one time oh, that, oh, oh. Uh, yeah, I, I know. But that's the one time Quentin Flynn actually voiced Mickey. And ah. he, yeah, and he, he actually mimicked Wayne Allwine's take on the character so flawlessly that I didn't even know it was him. Oh god, we're gonna have a dream within a dream. Mm-hmm. It looks like it. This is major dreamception right here. Uh huh. Oh, oh god. Whoa. And by the way, another mini game. You ever play Parappa the Rapper? This is basically that. Watch Mickey's dance moves very carefully, the one in the black and white. Dance to the rhythm with the A button and the control stick. Gotta get the timing down. Right, left, right, right left. space, right space, left, right space, left. Oh boy. Three, two, here we go. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Aha! Very nice. Indeed, I was right in our Sunday. Oh boy, right, 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 left, left. Right, right, left, left. Right, right, left. Oh, we're washing the windows. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left. Sorry if you could actually hear the control stick. No, I don't hear it. Oh, it's okay. All right, that was round two. Okay, this time it's left, right, right. Left, right, left, left, right. Somebody's trying to copy the Konami code. Almost. Right, left. <laughs> right, almost. Nah, the Tanami code is up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. Or, then, or if you're doing two player mode, up, 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 down, 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 down left, left, right, left, right, left, right, B, A, select, select start. start. Right, right, B, A, I forgot the B, A part. <laughs> Rain was just already. 
Actually, that was an Easter egg uh, in uh, No Players Online. Huh. Mickey. Wake Mickey. up. Wake up, buddy boy. What? Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's an imagine can we go. Okay. Well, we still have that fridge to check out. Oh yeah, that's right. To the blue door. Well, that's right, we can access it from the bottom of the stairwell, I forgot. Yeah. All righty, there we go. Okay. This? <laughs> so we're just playing through the whole game now, then, huh? We might as well. We've come this far. Yeah, but <laughs> editing you is gonna be screaming in pain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, why no. did we go through all this? Oh. And I still have yet to finish the uh, No More Heroes 2 videos. Yeah. Well, by the time I'm recording this. Mm -hmm. Ah. Oh. Time for a trick. Or a snowy treat. Mm hmm. Is it weird that it makes me want to get a blizzard? Mm. Eh. I've been. I haven't had a good old Dairy Queen blizzard in a while. <laughs> Still, there is none near me nowadays. Oh, shame. Like, there's one not too far from me, but, uh... I mean, like, uh... I will say, though, um... I, I will say, though, uh... Their chili oh. dogs... Their chili dogs are pretty good. Like, I do enjoy their chili dogs. The main uh, Dairy Queen I've been to mainly it just serves, like, the frozen treats. They do uh, not have the hot foods. Okay, I see. Also, you notice that Mickey's on a snowboard. Mickey the snowboarder. Boy clips walls and trees while showing off your skills. Smash into the snowman. Reach the goal within the time limit. Black stars to extend your time limit. 1080 avalanche, eat your heart out. <laughs> no way for that to come to, this, to the N64 library. Oh, 1080 Welcome snowboarding. Mario Party 3. I don't know why the music is tropical here. Yeah, wrong place. Yeah, uh... Yeah, uh, where's, uh, Mario Sunshine when you need it? Oh, wait, I don't have it anymore. You don't even have 3D All-Stars? No, it... Lo no, it was already gone by the time I got my Switch. Ah, uh, okay. Well, at least I have it. Ooh, snowman. <laughs> okay, come on. I, I swear, when I think of snowman, I think of that one episode of Curse the Cowardly Dog. Oh? But snowman. I was gonna say, oh, 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 geez. Oh. Yeah, um. Mickey became George of the Jungle there. <laughs> yeah, um. I was gonna say, because, uh. In. I was gonna say, uh. I think. What, what was that game? Uh. Clay Fighter. There we go. That's what I was thinking of. Oh, uh, bad Mr. Frosty. Yeah, bad Mr. Frosty. Wouldn't that be an interesting crossover? Courage the Cowardly Dog with the Clay Fighter characters? Yeah. I would more so think Blob would be a good character to be on that show. Yeah. It'd still be a funny <laughs> crossover to do, though. Yeah. What about with Boogerman? Oh, Booger Man. Oh, God. <laughs> wouldn't, 
Oh, and wait, wait a minute. What is ah. this? It's... Um, now we're stealing Mario's shtick. Now we really are stealing Mario's shtick. Mr. Miyamoto, I want to sue. <laughs> okay, to be fair, the painting doesn't sneeze Mario what? out. At a point. Okay. So, now the only thing we have to do now is, believe it or not, we actually have to go back to the, um... to the clock tower, to where the clock tower was. Uh, oh, because we actually have enough for... Wait. Do we have enough? Uh, we might? I'm not sure. Okay. Yeah, we might. We we actually might. Four o'clock. Wait, so if we start at And we four, gotta subtract one six Oh we actually do have enough. Yeah, I think we do. We just need one for the pole vault. But eight for the clock spin. Yeah. Madame, will you please let us through? Go right ahead. Thank you. Is it weird to say that I have that uh, that uh, retooled version that I made of the uh, the at Doom's Gate theme for my wake up sound now? Oh my goodness! Originally, it was the uh, the opening stage for uh, for uh, Mega Man X Corrupted. Ooh, now that's a fan game nobody has heard about in a long while. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. Brick. Huh? Ah. Ah! Okay, here we go again. Ooh, ouch. <laughs> uh, I don't think people want to see get M Mickey get... Well... He's not bleeding, though. Yeah, this is cartoon violence. And this is an E10 game, if I remember correctly. No, it's just E. E10 was not a thing yet. I'm still surprised that E10 was just like a later addition for the more uh, kid kid friendly like team rated games. Mhm. Mm All right, here we go. Do I have enough? No, I do not. I think we just needed one more. By the toll of the bell, it will be six o'clock. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ha <laughs> ha! We did have enough. Well, to reach the oh, so oh, so that's what that does. Like it does extend him out far enough to even reach it. I told you. Okay, so uh. Yeah. We just need to go down and get that piece in. I believe we now can reach the 12 o'clock mark. I think. Well, we don't need to do the 12 o'clock thing because we now will we'll have it soon. Oh, 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 oh,
The balloon can wait. A balloon? Get out of here, Pennywise. I was actually more so referencing Toonstruck. Uh, well, I haven't, I haven't seen that, so... Yeah, it's a point-and-click adventure game that was on PC back during, like, I want to say it was the mid-90s, and it starred Christopher Lloyd. Wait, Toonstruck? Yes. Oh, oh, that, that name sounds so familiar. I actually think I recognize that game now. It has Christopher Lloyd. Um, yeah, it's coming back to me Tim now. Tim Curry as well, as well, in the game, I remember. Oh, oh, Tim Curry was in that game as well. Interesting. Yeah, he was the voice uh, the, He was actually uh, the voice of an antagonist in the game. Hmm, interesting. Like, as soon as you hear his voice, you're like, oh, that's Tim Curry. Mm-hmm. Of course, we have to sit through this again. Eh, fast forward. Uh huh. We're, or I can just cut. Eh, we'll see what editing Akira does, considering uh, right now he's got over two hours of footage to work with. Yeah. Yeah, we're not doing this trick again, by the way, because uh, we already got the star holder this time. True. With the toll of the bell, it shall be three o'clock. For whom, for whom the bell tolls. Ring the bells of Notre Dame. <laughs> Ugh, that was a little flat. <laughs> I am so sorry for any hunchback of Notre Dame fans that are watching. <laughs> who is the monster and who is the who man? Is the Really was a good lesson to learn. Yeah. Oh, it's no ordinary balloon. It's a Mickey balloon. You have no choice, my boy. <laughs> Are you ready for some tight roping? No, we'll we'll get it. We'll get it. <sighs> oh. Wait, is it transparent? I believe so. Ha ha ha! To the real world with ya! Hmm. Not this what time. What if we try ringing the bell? We already did that. I already did that last time. Oh. Okay, can I... There we go. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the, the clicking is a little bit finicky with uh, where I can click and where I can't. True. And we got the shard that was there, so I don't need to go down that way anymore. Um. To be honest, it would be a lot more fun if, it's, if Mickey slid down the railing. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
na 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 na. <laughs> oh, I swear, sometimes we have too much fun in this channel. Uh, very true. I don't think there's anything to the right. No, there's not. And we, there's nothing more down there in the basement. No. Because we already I'm destroyed yeah. the year supply of root beer. Hmm. Eh, well. Hmm? Oof. Yeah, I'm not taking that drop. Hmm. I'm but we must cross! I'm mashing, I'm mashing! <laughs> well, it's better than that uh, one minigame from uh, Star Fox Adventures where I have to button mash. Oh, let's head to the bathroom. Oh, that's right, we can actually go there now. And we can get the star holder that's in there. Uh huh. So, uh... Now we gotta wait for the screen. So Now we gotta wait for Mickey to be like... Oh, then the screen to just, like, flicker in and out. Yeah. But, uh, I was gonna say, uh... Like, did you ever... Like, I don't know if you ever played this or not. Because I might... I, I know I have, because I used to own it. Uh, but you ever... But I guess you never played, uh... I can only guess that you've never played, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, mm -hmm. Goofy's Fun House, I think it was? Uh, no, I haven't played it, but I watched a review on it from Cat Icarus. Yeah, it's it's not great. The well, it is a game for kids. Yeah, the game is alright for what it is, and I was the right age to enjoy it when I got it. But at the same time, I also got, uh, what was it, uh... But that was, like, around the same time that I got stuff like Spider-Man, uh, the first one, not the second one. Uh... Yeah. Uh, Spyro, like, Yeah, I also got, uh, Spyro 1, uh... Ooh, that was a good one. Yeah, um, and there was also Scooby-Doo in the Cyber Chase, which is basically discount oh, Crash I Bandicoot. Oh, I love that one, to be yeah, honest. It's, yeah, it's, 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 di it's just discount cr uh, Crash Bandicoot. But that second level, the well, second world. <laughs> Ugh, yeah. Like, the game's fun and all, but I will never go back to Rome. Yeah, never. Give me the... I they had a more fun ice world compared to Donkey Kong Country. Oh, yeah. <gasps> ah! You! <laughs> you! <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait a, minute. a second. I, I think we have something. Ah, uh, wait a minute. Let's get back to the edge over there. Ah, uh, I have to get back to the edge, though? No, I can't. Oh, there we go. Blup, 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 blup. <sighs> <laughs> that stinking little Aww. fish. Oh. Wait a second. We got a can! This is a tricky one. So can we do it? <laughs> can we catch the fish? Wait a second, there was a fish in that bowl. Which I did nothing with. Oh yeah, that's right. Here we go. Instead of getting mad at the fish, I think the fish just wanted company. Okay, that was actually cute. <laughs> gotcha. Now we got, got a can full of water and a fish. Now we just oh, gotta oh. get to. Now we just gotta get to our friend, the fish in the bowl, and deliver him his mate. 
I guess. Or companion, depending on the, okay. the whole things with the fish, guess. Ah. Uh -huh. yes. Hushu! Chips is. Hushu! Is that tight? Thank you. Tally ho! Hushu! Yes, I'm tight. It might be a little dusty in here. I think you need a duster. I don't have it with me though. So I can't do much about it right now. Mm. <sighs> Ellie! Oh, oh, come on! Okay, w uh, the, the build up is nice, but come on. We're waiting. There we go, much better. And we're doing nothing. And he sticks the landing. Roughly, well, roughly, but uh, close enough, I suppose. Ladies and gentlemen, our new champion, Mickey the Mouse! Mm-hmm. Huh. <sighs> Now we gotta go to this door over here. What was that? I was just closing a bag of flaming hot Doritos. Ooh. I said. Which flavor did you get? Flaming hot. Flaming hot, you poor soul. Okay. I actually bought it like, like two weeks ago. Ooh. For a try not the last stream that I did two weeks ago. Oh, I and see. Wait. Hmm. And uh, oh, I ate so hmm. many. I ate five chips per lap. Wow. Hmm. Hmm. This is a tricky one. Is it? This is the third time, now. time. You can get the marble out. Oh. Oh. I like I like that the music the music changes slightly when it's from the perspective wow. of the fish. Ah, we got the marble. Ah, but we have something in trade. Well, we have to get the marble first. True. Also, wait, also there's three doors? Gotcha. Go. Gee, watch this. We have something in trade, my friend. A nice little fish friend for you.
Yes, I know, slow charging. <laughs> oh? Um. The star holder. All right. Ah. Okay. All right. I think it was the one on the left that we didn't enter through. Well, I don't know yet. No, we haven't been in here. Hmm. Ooh, another trick. <laughs> Hello? Oh, there we go. Ah, he's easy this time. <laughs> hey, what is out of here? <laughs> Essentially, that's our hand. <laughs> We have another mirror piece. Woo! Nice! Now back to the mirror! Right, which of the two pieces is it gonna be? Oh, it, it's not two pieces. It completed the whole mirror! Well, look at that. But then, what's the point with us getting the marble in those holes? Another star holder, I think. Yeah, let's go for the true 100% then. Yeah. All right. Now that's the door we came from, so we don't want to go there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This way to go all the way to that door okay. over there because that's the only one that you can actually open. That isn't a trick door, I mean. Yep. And now through that door. No, we're not going through this blue spiral door. No, 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 I know what I meant. I wasn't saying the blue door. Okay, now I just have to remember which hole it is. It can go up and down the stairs to figure out. Mm -hmm. Hmm. It's that one. Uh, okay, it's that hole. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go. A true 100 percent let's go
Aha! There we go! Alright, I think we have just about everything that I can get. Mm -hmm. I think. I could be wrong, there might be some things that I'm missing, but uh, I don't know, and I don't care. Show them the trick that was in the office. What? That we didn't do before. Wait, what? With the chair. In the office where we had tea. Oh, I see. Just, just for the heck of it. Yeah, why not? Might as well show it off at least once. Ah, but before we do that, another transparent uh -huh. item. Makes me glad we came back in here. Gotcha. Benny would have definitely killed us if he didn't have that. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, that's all there was to it. <laughs> <laughs> I still love that, to be honest. <laughs> I'm okay. Okay, that's good. On the way! Look at the window! Yeah, I see it. It's the bee! No, that's not a B. You can't even interact with it. Or can we? Oh. Oh, it just... <coughs> oh, I had to take a little trot there. <sighs> okay. All right. I think Upward. we have, Yeah, we have literally everything that there is to get, I think. Well, for now. For now. I say for now. Oh, there is an, for now. Well, there is an extra challenge, but I'll get into that uh later, a little bit later. We have a we have ourselves a uh a mirror to get through. Mm -hmm. Indeed, the whole mirror. And the cutscene's playing by itself. Hmm. <laughs> Let's get going. Gosh. What? Oh. What? You again? What do you want this time? What? It's only? I thought all you put that through! You expect us to forgive you just like that? Hmm. Just no. like that? <laughs> uh -huh. I'm... Hmm? Wait... Oh. I see what's going on. He doesn't want us to leave. But we have no choice. We can't stay asleep forever. Indeed. 
You know, not for nothing game, but subtitles would have been appreciated. Indeed. Yeah, by the way. You by the way, this is what happens if you get the best ending. Or th this is why it's considered the best ending. You have to get all of the. You have to get the entire mirror, all the all of the mirror pieces. <laughs> yeah. And that's the reason for the Lilo and Stitch reference I did earlier. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright. No, it's literally just the same thing, but in reverse. Yep. Cheese. Oh, because he's a mouse, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and the little goes flying around in the room. Mm hmm. And there we have it, folks. So. I did all of that in one sitting, everyone. That was Disney's Magical Mirror starring Mickey Mouse. It doesn't get that much love, which is kind of a shame, because I, I can't. I honestly can't help but say that I have a big soft spot for this game. I want to say it was mainly because of the fact of this being a, like a different kind of genre of game. Getting Mickey actually doing Shoryukens and Hadoukens here. And, uh. uh Tornado <laughs> Kick. Yes. Basically. I swear, that's like Capcom saying, hey, as a forgiveness for not bringing in Street Fighter 3 to, to the GameCube or Nintendo 64. We'll let you make you be a Ryu for a while. <laughs> oh my god. I wonder how many hurdles Akon had to do to get this to happen. Yeah, featuring the yeah, featuring the voice talent of the late Wayne Allwine. Oh, may he rest in peace. Yeah. Okay, Disney character voices, Rita Kendon I don't know. I can't say those. Renee Johnson, Suze Loom. Ryan Monroe and Susan Ryan. Special thanks Roy E. Disney, Jan E. Smith, I Pamela Weisberg. I forgot Roy was still around when this game was in development. Oh, that's right. He's no longer with us, is he? No. Oh, such a shame. And I got a text message. I'll get to that later. Yeah. Hiroshi Yamabuchi was the executive producer. And wait! Wait! What? Did Giro Miyamoto help produce this game? Hmm, you Squeeze must, me? He must have been a big Disney fan. I don't know. 
Maybe. So that would help explain a little bit how they managed to find a way to bring Sora into Smash Brothers. <laughs> Well, I mean, uh, I think Sakurai was a huge Kingdom Hearts fan as well, unless unless uh, some of the developers for, uh, working working on uh, uh, working on uh, Smash Bros really liked Kingdom Hearts as well. I don't know. Yeah, and fun fact from what I learned, I mean, even though Sora was actually ranked number one overall for the Smash Ballot. Where Enix was the one who was nervous about bringing him to Smash Brothers. Really? Or Disney. Hmm. Yeah, throughout all this time, I was thinking Disney was the main head of bringing Sora into Smash. But in reality, it was actually Square Enix themselves. Hmm. Interesting. Like, they, they were okay with Cloud being in there. It was like just Cloud during the Smash 4 period. Yeah. But then came along Sephiroth, which helped open the door even wider. Yeah. Oh, with and... the help. But I think whoever convinced Square Enix to give them the okay just helped burst the door open wide open. Mm hmm. Actually, I'm just right now still a little shocked that Mr. Miyamoto was part of the producing team for this game. Oh, by the way, look at the number score. Oh! <laughs> you know what? Just for the sake of it, I'm going to leave it there. How dare you! <laughs> had to. I had to. <laughs> Capcom, all staff, thanks for playing... Well, thank you for producing this game. I actually really enjoyed it. It's uh, it's got it. It's got its charms. Very underrated title in the Capcom library. Yeah, a lot of people don't like it, but uh, it, I, I personally do. I think many people just don't under, like the genre. Uh oh, oh, oh. Uh, it did not 100% a truly. If you have the. If you save the game clear data, the bonus room and hat hunt mode will become available. Oh. Okay to save clear game data? Yes. Oh, so this what you were talking about? Yeah, partially. Oh. Yes. Wow. Wow. Yeah, there's the bow, there's the picture of Minnie and Mickey, there's the Donald plush. And there's the picture right above his bed of uh, of Mickey and uh, his friends. And there be the balloon. Uh huh. Oh, we can actually look it over. Yeah. Uh, no Daisy to be seen, unfortunately. Eh, it's just a picture of the Fab Five. I guess. But yeah, uh, oh, and the bee is here as well. Oh my god, the bee. Oh. Oh, are you pushing the A button? Yes. <laughs> uh, what does the snowman do? Oh, nothing. It's just a snowman. Yeah, it's just a snowman. over our little ghost buddy and the voice is a little pitched up this time around which is funny <laughs> yeah there's the cake hey. yummy yeah there's the cake that we did that dancing mini game on alrighty uh, we didn't there's the mansion, or which looks like a castle, but that's okay. To be honest, it actually looks like Disney Castle from Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, a little bit. There's the cuckoo clock, and there's a windmill. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's the... 
It's the bronze pointer finger. Mm-hmm. So yeah, there's not really much else that I can look at. And All I can't right, now. and I yeah, and I can't go back into the mirror. Okay. And if we leave, that's the end of the game. The game just ends and it goes back to the title screen. I guess I can yeah, show off I guess I can show off a few of the extras. Get back to normal mode, check your memory card. Oh? Yeah, there's a bonus room. Where we can basically play all of the mini games. Uh, the dancing mini game, the flying mini game, the one where you have to avoid the sword, uh, the guitar, guitar hero, the snowboard, and uh, the barrels. Hmm. And uh, the TV is there to uh, show us the cutscenes that we got through the playthrough, and the jukebox is the sound test. Ah, so that's how you unlock the sound test. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this was, uh, I'll, I'll be honest, this was, uh, kind of fun. <laughs> Indeed. So, that was fun. Uh, yep. no, no, I'm, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do that this time. There's nothing really too special with the hats. It's, oh, this has been a magical mirror. Sorry, Mickey Mouse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, almost three hours now. Editing Akira is screaming right now. <laughs> Ak Editing Akira is crying. <laughs> He's just in the corner being like, why did we do all this? I still have to go through No More Heroes 2. <laughs> uh, I guess it'll be worth it. But uh, in yeah. any case, in any case, this will probably just be one video anyway, but with a lot of chunk, uh, a lot of extra chunk uh, taken out. And that's going to be taken editing care for a while. So yeah. Thank you for doing all that. Yeah. Thanks, future me. <laughs> but uh, until then, but until next time, everybody, make sure you keep your gaming spirits alive. Yeah. And uh, nobody really requested me to play this game. Uh, I just wanted to because I had it. If I ever choose to do another GameCube title, uh, Andrew and everybody else is going to have to look at the spreadsheet because those are all the games that I own, although I will have to rework some of the uh, entries. Change some of the co color coronations? Yes. I may have been uh, a little bit, yeah, but some of them I was a little bit harsh, but still. Yeah, I was gonna say, some of them were pretty harsh. Yeah. I won't say, unless Akira managed to post it onto Twitter, where I will retweet it. We tweet it. <laughs> <laughs> but until next playthrough, everybody, my name has been Andrew, the YouTuber critic, reviewer of games, movies, YouTubers, TV series, and streamers. And, of course, I am Akira Strix, or... Trickster Fox, whichever you want to go with. Thank you, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. Please make sure to leave a like and a comment down below if you want to see more content that I post. If you want to see more content that I post as well, uh, just make sure to click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you don't miss an upload from me. Uh, go follow, uh, go follow uh, Andrew on. Uh, on Twitter as well as uh, as well as his Twitch page. Mhm. Mm I've actually, as of this recording, I am actually sitting at 29 followers. May go up before this video goes up, so who knows? But yeah. Also, yeah, make sure you follow my Twitter because I will be posting my weekly Twitch streaming schedule over there. Mhm. Mm It'll be it will be the pin tweet. Okay. All so right. We'll see you next time, Fox Squad. See you guys next time.